We celebrate today the feast of Saint Matthew, who was an apostle of Jesus and also one of the four evangelists. Matthew, according to his own gospel, was a tax collector. At the time of Jesus, tax collectors were looked at with suspicion, tax collectors were looked at with anger, tax collectors were looked at negatively. So everyone who passed by Matthew's office would see a thief, would see a person to be looked at with suspicion, would look negatively at Matthew. Jesus passes by the same office along which so many had passed before. And Jesus sees in Matthew, whom everyone's looked at negatively, a potential disciple because Jesus was able to see in people the potential that even they were not aware that they had. And so Jesus invites Matthew to a new way of life. He invites Matthew to a life in which there will be no cheating and no stealing and no taking advantage of the unfortunate. And Matthew accepts that commission and comes along with Jesus. The question is, how do I usually look at people? Do I look at people with a positive frame of mind or do I look at them with blinkered eyes? Do I stereotype people based on their background, based on the color of their skin, based on the religion they profess, based on the language they speak, based on the food they eat? Or do I try to see the inside of a person and avoid judging? Jesus was able to see not only the chicken in the egg, he was able to see the eagle in the egg and that is why Matthew could soar and soar so high. When you look at the egg, will you also see the eagle? You are writing a gospel, a chapter each day by the words that you speak and the things that you say. People read what you write, whether false or true. Now, what is the gospel according to you?